So water tank. In um, water in a tank is pressurized by air, and the pressure is measured by a uh, multi-fluid manometer, as shown in this figure, 1-53. The tank is located on a on a mountain at an altitude of 1,400 meters, where the atmospheric pressure atmospheric pressure is. 85.6 so this is the atmospheric pressure determine the air Determine the air pressure in the tank. I'm sorry, this is the air pressure. Where is this? Air pressure in the tank is H1. So this is H1. So if you you have to start from suppose this is P1. This is The atmosphere it is open this tube is open to atmosphere so I'm gonna start from here downward and keep on adding and subtracting the pressures so remember pressure equals to rho G H this is the main formula for uh, pressure so let us start from from this side air where from this side okay so right now this is enclosed the air is not open this tube is not open to the pressure so the left hand side is p1 and then if you take a look let me close this one. now that if you take a look going down so you have to take a draw a line so that the difference between the two pressures is this head so this is h1 so it is when you see the pressure it is uh, going down uh, then you have to add that pressure rho g h1 where h1 is the head difference of the um, two levels between the between the two tubes this is tube number one uh, and this is tube number two so if you take the difference is h1 so going down now if you go up you still see there is no difference there is no difference here so now there is um, another difference in head you see this is a different fluid okay this is a different fluid then this is uh, this is oil this is mercury uh, a little bit um, blurry in our case this is water so we have three types of fluids which have their own uh, pressure heads so we have to figure out uh, which pressure head is for what uh, fluid you have to draw a line and then the extra head is the pressure head now this pressure head h2 you have to think whether it is coming in the downward direction if it is coming in the downward direction which which it is then you have to add that I would say this is for oil okay this is for W stands for water oil rho G H2 now you have to talk about the third pressure this is the third uh, type of the um, fluid which is mercury now again from here you are going up going up 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 now you see the difference you draw a line this is the difference this much is the pressure head and now you will see this is the head difference when we are going up so when you are going up you have to subtract I would say mercury and then equals to the atmospheric pressure 
so this is how you would calculate now you would plug in everything so let's find out the pressure the atmospheric pressure is given 85.6 h1 is given h2 is given h3 is given take the densities densities of water which is 1000 oil which is 850 mercury which is 13600 kg per meter cubed so if you solve for this I give you some time you should solve for this and let me know if you get uh, 130 kilo pascals this would be your answer